Hey guys, it's Ozzy Reptiles here, and today I'm doing another full collection update uh, just because I've had a couple of changes, so I thought I'd give you guys a look at that. So I've got my cabinet here and my speakers and stuff, games and stuff. Ignore the mess also because this this room change has been very recent, so it's very messy still. Um, so yeah, instead of having the tanks in there, they're not in there anymore. Uh, instead of the fish tank being that smaller one, it's now into this, which is the old blue tongue one. So it's called the, what's that, Apple one, and then it's the AR620 aquarium tank. It's got it. Um, I can't really show you from it. It's got the water, um, the light, sorry, in it. Um, and then for the bubbler there, and then the bubbler slash sponge filter back there. I've got the Aqua One, what's that, Infinity AP750. Yeah, so it works, water's clear. So I've got this plant, whatever it is, doing well, it's growing tall. This plant, again, whatever it is, sorry, I really didn't pay attention to the names of the plant. Um, Java Fern, Java Fern, Java Fern, Java Fern, they're doing great. Uh, a couple of bits of Java Moss there and there. Um, and I had this plant which is this plant back there but the goldfish um, uncolored goldfish came along just completely ate the leaves off it and stuff pulled it out so I'm gonna have to get something different for there because they completely destroyed that plant unfortunately one of my orange mollies died um, so now there's only one of them left so I might get another one for that one got two white clouds still uh, Corydoras the bronze Corydoras one back there the one there um, have a catfish swimming at the back there, neon tetras back there, golden barbs, uncolored goldfish, um, and then guppy, um, and there's a female guppy, um, down there, and then there's here, just there, yep. Um, also there next to the redfish is Alfred, the one-eyed, um, golden barb. So I thought I'd just tell you guys that. So then you move here, Xbox, and Xbox One, Citrus, um, they've just been fed, so there's, that's where Mealworms were, and then she's got some mandarins there, um, Citrus fruit, for Citrus, so her tank is back into the one that she was in, uh, so let's just focus it, not on the light, so Citrus is there, um, if you follow me on Instagram, you would have seen a posted photo of her. She had like bright orange. Uh, it's died down a little bit now since it's night time. So, um, you don't, it's like, I guess she just didn't, um, she had the colours through the sun coming through the window and stuff. Fake echidna, cricket tub, which she loves as a hide. Uh, fake plants, water bowl, heat light and so on, and citrus, of course. So that's her. Then we move to here my shoes this is the water skink which once again as typical is not out oh actually wait I like this here is big boy the water skink need some water skink so that's its enclosure water bottle which I need to fill up um, some gum leaves and some bark for it to hide under so that's big boy the water skink. Um, so as you've seen, I got these racks. Um, also sitting on one. So the what the racks are is for now they're storing the tanks on top, but later on in time they will be the tanks themselves. So the tanks are they would be adjustable from the shelves, so I can make the tanks whatever size I want, whatever. Length, like I could have a tank starting here, going through into the corner piece shelf, and even out onto this one again. Um, so that should be cool, can't wait. So we've got Rango. He's just got his infrared um, light. Log, slash hide. Some fake, uh, what's it called, like old man's beard or something, I'm not sure, 100%. Uh, fake echidna, water bottle, rock, fake plant. And there's a little ceramic house my girlfriend made me. And Rango. Rango the OG reptile. Uh, so yeah.
one of those uh, my girlfriend and I in Queensland. Um, down below that, we have Viper. Viper is another male central bearded dragon. He's got some yellow colouring to him. Um, background that I made, not the best, but you know, got a fake kookaburra and a fake cockatoo in it. Um, mandarins again, and this was mealworms. Um, a salad food dish which has just been completely trashed and a huge water bowl as citrus loved to soak in it. Some more gum leaves and yeah, log slash hide. And then there's citrus, uh, oh, god damn it, there's Viper with his heat light. So yeah, then we move up here, in here, back there, can't see for crap. So this is... One of my little yabbies, as you can see there, there's little things moving. She's got eggs. So hopefully they hatch, that'd be good. Um, so hopefully that works. Got the uh, mosquito fish, the normally in Rex's tank, the water dragon. So up here then we have the four baby green tree frogs. There's one, two, three, um, and four back there. So they're awesome, growing up well, grown in heaps since we got them. Oh, now we freaked out. So that's good. Move across to here. Angleheads. Um, so there's the one up there. And if we see it right here, there's the other little one right there. So hunting down some crickets. So that's them. Um, UV light is out on Rex uh, for now as well. Now I'm going to get them their own personal one because I'm like, I can't be bothered changing them around anymore, so they're getting their own soon. Uh, up here, we've got the yellow blue tongue, half melanistic blue tongue, and the babies. Uh, and since they're the last things in the room, we'll get them out, so let's do that. So again, if you follow me on Instagram, you'd know that I've changed the bedding or substrate in the blue tongues enclosures from straw uh, uh yeah so so hay and just newspaper to this aspen wood chippy stuff so that's good gives them the ability to burrow into that um so i've got the bowl for like other foods right now it's got some mealworms in it and then the water bowl with some news paper no, 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 newspaper underneath so that way it absorbs the water better um so here we lift up her hide this is what I like to call my tiger phase blue tongue. So her name's Tigeris. She's actually, like, she's a beautiful lizard. Um, I've, I say this all the time. But, like, honestly, I'm very happy to have her. And especially if it is, like, a one of a kind. Um, so she's just so yellow and brown. And there again, she's an eastern blue tongue. So that's a very... Uh, uncommon like color, f color for an eastern blue tongue. Normally they're the grey. It's like she's still got a bit of a grey tail as you can see there. But she shed and she became yellow. It's eating some of the mandarins. So yeah, that's uh, Tigris. Put her back. Put her hide back on top. And we'll put the lid back on top again. So yeah, citrus. Uh, God damn it. There's Tigerus. Now I'll get the hypermelanistic blue tongue out. So here we have the hypermelanistic blue tongue. Got this hide that I made. It's just some styrofoam that I've put some um, some cement. Just painted a little bit of cement. I'll be redoing it because it's a crap job, but I mean it works perfectly. She's got two entries to it. Works well. Uh, again, same bowls, water concept, and the uh, mealworms, and then the same concept with the uh, the uh, newspaper. So this is toothless, my male hypermelanistic blue tongue. Um, he's really awesome. So happy with the purchase of him. I like the way he walks. Like he just does some huge like overlaps with his legs and. <laughs> it's really funny. Blip. Blip. 
kind of as if he's like trying to back like swim in a pool like yeah so yeah he's awesome absolutely love him um so yeah we'll move on to the baby blue tongues so guys here we have um blue and echo uh is any of them under here nope not this time again same things Bowl, bowl, newspaper. Um, so they're both obviously. Yep. <laughs> Come on. Don't you just love when the blue tongue's so attached to a tide? This is blue. Um, so they're four months old. Uh, cause it's winter, it's hard to get your blue tongues to really eat. Um, so they're not really growing that much. But they have grown um, still from when I first got them. And then this is Echo, which um, may not show it in. I don't know if I've done a video on it or if my Instagram has a photo, but she used to be a dark lizard. Like, she was really dark, so you could easily tell them apart. Like, I can still tell them apart, of course, but she has gone like so light now in color. And she's even got like this tingy yellow in her. So it's just a really nice lizard. Of course, these two are just normal eastern blue tongues, but what's wrong with having a couple of normals? Nothing. So, yeah, that's them. Really love them. And so this will um, end the video of the reptile room um, or collection. I've got the water dragon, the turtle, and two other frogs. Uh, out there like out of my room but I'll do another video on them uh, later on in time so guys this concludes the video of the reptile room tour um, leave a like comment down below or what you want to see next as always I'll catch you guys in the next video peace out